worthy of your call. I think reading the Bible is also fine. Yeah. Because like, like if there's something you don't understand, it's like you do that thing. I think too, like, the people who you're doing what you're doing with, you know, it matters. I know me and my friends, we can do something just as stupid as just going to the mall with each other. But right. we'll laugh all day and we'll have, like, the best time ever. So, you know, that's also important, like, the people you surround yourself with. Absolutely. And like-minded people at the Absolutely. Time. Absolutely. You're going to have, and I see it down, you're going to have more difficulty trying to be a Christian around the people that want, don't want to be like you. If you're hanging around people that don't want to be a Christian, and I think somebody brought it up earlier, oh, you brought it up earlier, and they said, let's go to the club, and you're like, no, nah, I ain't going to go to the club. Then you end up going to the club so you can help them do what's right. Now, I'm just going to stand here, and if you start sinning, I'm going to come in, you know, I'm going to rebuke you and let you know, God. <laughs> <laughs> Next thing you know, you're like, yeah, God don't like me. <laughs> <laughs> you, 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 you have to surround yourself with people that are like-minded, that have the same goals as you. You know, when you're in school and you want to bring around people that want to, they don't care, they want to fail, cut class. Yeah, I probably go to these dances. <laughs> but if you're around people that don't care about God, don't want to know God, don't want to live right, they want to drink, they want to smoke weed, you know, they want to get crook, I think, what they call it. Then you, I mean, you, just, you know what? You're guilty by association. Because you're gonna, if you're in a car with somebody that's carrying some stuff, you're going to jail too. Because you are in proximity of that. Now, if you didn't know and stuff like that, then that's for the courts to decide. But you choose what's going to be around you. Right? And I know that, you know, for me, well, I'll leave that one alone. I know, I was going to say, I know for me, I want to be somebody who makes money in this world. I want to be somebody who doesn't just live an ordinary life and go to school and go home, go to work, go home, and that's it. So I need to surround myself with people that are what I want to be. I need to surround my people, myself with people that, okay, we're going to study for our test. Now, okay, I'm going to study too, because even when I don't feel like it, like, come on. And for the brothers, y'all know, sometimes we don't feel like working out. You know, it's, it's like, well, I ain't going to the gym today. We, I bought how many memberships to gyms? Man, I, I bought a, a rec center membership. I haven't gone once. Can I help me? That one right there? That one right there? I know I need to go with you. <laughs> but it's nice. I, I, I walked around it and looked at the facility. <laughs> but that, does that count? <laughs> Raise the Lord. That, that's, that's the Holy Ghost. Some people come to church and look around. That don't make them a Christian. But... You see, now, if me, you know, my brother right here is like, yo, let's go work out. I'm tired, now. Come on, man. You can do this. Let's do it. You, you, you think I'm going to be influenced to go? But if I'm around folks that they sitting down on the couch, belly, hitting their toes, <laughs> eating a donut, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Am I going to want to go to the gym? Maybe, but... <laughs> You need people that act like to you. You need people that are living the way they're supposed to. And that helps to influence. So is that it? No more ideas of what Christians can do? Because that's really the crux of it. Sweet. Homework. That's not fun. The devil is a lie. <laughs> you ever see fun? So anybody that got to give it a quick so you can have more fun. You want to cultivate your thing. <laughs> All right, I gotta really go home. All right. Yeah. So we're gonna close now. All right. Um, so I just wanna thank you guys all for coming. I hope um, the misconceptions were cleared up. If you have any questions, any more further questions, just hit me up and I'll be able to help you and direct you to where you need to go. And also, just remember, if you haven't, to sign the paper from Mimi, and I'll be able to forward you the PowerPoint. And I just want to leave off on this verse. It says, all things are lawful for me, but all things are not ex expedient. Ex sorry, I can't speak English. <laughs> all things are lawful for me, but all things edify not. So basically, all things are, um, you're allowed to do it, but you have to determine what is good for your soul, what is good 
for the edification of your soul. And we're just going to leave on a prayer, so can we all just stand? If you want to. And I just want to make a quick announcement. We have service on Sunday at SOM 133 at 11 o'clock. Um, yes, Richard? Yes, yeah, we always have. Well, we don't always have. What? Oh, no. Oh, yeah. So we're going to have a speaker. And um, please make sure you're on the mailing list because as of right now, that might change. I mean, speaking of the venue, it might change. So just so you're updated on where we're going to have it, just give the email address to me. If you feel like your name isn't on the email list already, just give it to a different way so that if it changes or if it doesn't change, we'll just keep you updated. I'm most grateful to know this body. We just want to thank you. I want to be all the praise in the world. Thank you for allowing us to have this discussion with us. Father, I pray that every single person that came here and has our Father, that you speak with every person individually, Lord God, Father, and for this family, Jesus, of what you want them to be in this world, Father. We can ask you to just pray for us all. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name, Lord God, Father, and Father, 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 Um, there's our flyers are over there in the bar and we're going to see what happens. We have pens and we have candy for you to take. Thank you. Oh,